Let's create a new composition, and add a shape layer to it. Then we'll add a new white solid which will become our ground plane. We'll turn both layers into 3D layers, and rotate the ground plane 90 degrees on the x-axis. Let's pull the floor downwards a little bit so that it sits under the shape layer. Next we'll add a light with cast shadows turned on, and move it in a better position. Let's open up the material options for the shape layer and turn cast shadows on for it in order to see our shadow. For the floor layer, we're going to turn except lights off, so that it stays perfectly white. Let's also scale it up so that the shadow fits onto it better. Now we'll add a black solid and put it below everything else. Finally let's turn the blending mode of the floor layer to Silhouette Luma. If we go back to the active camera view, we can now see our shadows against a transparent floor. Let's add a camera so that we can rotate the view a bit. If you see a black edge, simply scale the floor layer to make it bigger. That's how you get shadow catchers in After Effects. Thanks for watching and see you next time on 1minutevideotutorials.com.